karibu tena katika YouTube channel yetu kama kawaida Kenya Daily na leo imekuwa muda mrefu kabla tufanye hapo content lakini leo uh, tumerudi na na kile ambacho labda tutakiita ni kama kulikuwa na expo safe fulani uh, ya Jemutai uh, Jemutai ambaye wengi wanamjua ni mcheshi ama mchekeshaji wa uh, Churchill show ambayo uh, hivi sasa haijakuwa ikiran kwa sababu ya mambo ya corona hivi hivi lakini huyu Jemutai anajulikana sana kwa sababu amekuwa ni uh, uh, comedian pale uh, Churchill show na watu wengi kwa kweli wanamkubali sana aso tena ilikuwa ni scandal ama tuseme ni expose fulani ambayo uh, ilikuwa inamhusisha comedian mwenzake ambaye ni cha, uh, na professor Hamo ambaye anajulikana kama professor Hamo Uh, Jemu Tai anasema kwamba Profesa Hamo uh, ni baba wa watoto wake kwa hivyo mm, amesema kupitia uh, uh, <laughs> amepitia am, 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 amesema kupitia the, 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 the exposer yani ule ule jamaa ku expose watu ule anaita Odiga Obari the famous blogger uh, aliweza kuongea na kumtumia voice message ambayo nitakuwa nakuchezea hivi sasa E, anasema kwamba ha profesa Hamo amekuwa ni baba wa watoto wake na hawajibiki kwa hivyo sijui tusikilize kwanza profesa Hamo ama Jimu tena anasema nini e, anapomwambia ana, ana, Edgar Obare kisha uniambie maoni yako ni yapi kuhusu e, jambo hili kwa sababu au wili ni makomedi ambao anakubalika sana na uh, jambo hili la jimutai kusema kwamba uh, profesa Hamo wajibiki uh, labda hafanyi mambo ambayo yanastahili kwa maana yeye ni baba wa watoto uh, labda mambo kama hayo sikiliza alafu utoe comment eh, katika comment section alafu kisha uh, usisahau ku subscribe unajua eh, sasa tunataka kufika 4000 subscribers katika Kenya Daily hebu sikiliza hii alafu niambie Hi Edgar It's jump time. Okay, I can't type because I have a slight headache and uh, I'm recovering from pneumonia. Na meza some very strong painkillers. So, I'm really shocked that someone reached out to you about Hamu. Ni kweli we have two beautiful kids together. One is almost turning five and the other one is one year, six months. So, I met hey, we met pale chatil show kitambo 2015. When Hamo was still living with the sister somewhere around the pipeline so we were like neighbors so tuko tunatoka kani tunaenda tunakaa Tajmol maybe tunaandika mistari after show tuna drop one na kings so after before ni endele na hiyo story there is Hamo ako na first wife anaishi na Kuru na mimi nilikuwa naishi Nairobi Before people come here trolling me, yes, tunajuana. She calls me, tunaongea vizuri. Hakuna mwingine ashaitukana na mwingine. Juzi, I, I think like uh, three weeks ago alinitumia hata pesa huyo mama. So, atuna bad blood. So, also auto zilikuja kwa gun blaze. <laughs> so, I got pregnant for Jeremy in 2016, around Feb there. By then uh, tuko tumeanza kuomoka vile but we were good names pale cha chill show he was doing good i was doing good so i got pregnant amoka nembe sasa jemtai you are pregnant me i'm protecting my 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 fame and uh, utajipanga ai nikaichukua nikajipanga so i went to my mom's place nikachukua vitu zangu i went and rented somewhere in pipeline kanyumba kadogo ka single room ndio niweze kulipa na niweze ku buy food so i lived there kuna tamata hamu alikujanga ku visit kwa nyumba used to nilikuwa nalalanga kwa flow sina gas <laughs> sina gas nilikuwa nalalanga chini sina gas so my neighbor alikuwa anitongwa sara mwini she can confirm alikuwa anapika kwa kile alafu ananiletea i was so pregnant heavily pregnant so i took a break church kuanzia si june may to 2017 feb so i gave birth to jeremy mm. So I gave birth in uh, November 20 something in November ikisha nilifanywa CS Jeremy alikuwa amepitisha 42 weeks na nikaindiusiwa for a long time alafu wako ana feel atubiti yake so daktari kanambia ni emergency CS nikafanywa CS eh nika try ku call hamu anisaidie na juu nilifanywa CS so sikuwa nimejipanga ni do enough alafu pia sikuwa job my answer that guy didn't, didn't even respond akusumbukana you know nikangangana vinyatotoka hospitali 
so nikatoka hospitali uh, after CS nikajua mamangu ali actually aliomba mama mwingine hapo bestie to into edna akatusaidia akatutumia tukalipa so when i went back december nikakaa na mtu hii december january kiendelea kuishaisha nikamwambia mother we can't live like this je mimi ndio na provide wacha niende job niangalie mtoto and i went back to chachil show mtu yongo kiwa na 2 months na niko na kidonda ya CS you the same same year 2016 na mwalikuwa mpata endorsement fulani amelipa 10 million so najiuliza mwanzo even alikam kuniona kwa hiyo nyumba si hata angenibaia na blanket ama nikae tu ama meko ama nisaidie kulipa hospitali as in anifanye kitu moja surprisingly amo akarudi 2017 hmm. siku moja tu on, somewhere in july when my baby was almost almost 8 months akani call can be jamu i'm so sorry for what i did i want to raise my son uh, kwetu atuachange watoto i want to be there for my son nikamwambia we, we met we talked kidogo kidogo akoja kuona madhangu akakuja home akaona mom akaambia mom anataka um, ku raise watu wake he was very sorry for what he did anataka kuwa responsible father na mama yangu akatambia sawa nyinyi ni watu wazima so from then tena tukaanza ku date mamwa narudi uh, mama tunamtanga mam ule mamwa nax the first wife tunamtanga mam so by the time anarudi mam was pregnant uh, i was pregnant in 2016 mam was pregnant in 2017 ndio apate mtu mdogo she's called natalie so kurudi hamu kidogo kidogo kanambia i want to go to south africa and i need money in my account by then i was doing so well nilikuwa nimehama nilikuwa nimepata contract line na safari kama i was doing well for myself yani tunaishi poa i had money so hamu akarudi akarudi kwa life yangu hiyo time around your time the mom akakuwa pregnant Ma asi atakakuwa alikuwa ake I'm so confused I, I don't know mama alikuwa pregnant na akuwa na within one year hamua kwa na do ya kulipa hospitali mama giving birth so akaniambia mama na give birth kama ile 50k nilikuweke kwa account ya South Africa sort bills zake mimi sina ubaya mlipie kila kitu na umfanye kama mlipie kila kitu na umfanye shopping that guy want to tell you that mimi hata Mom knows Lonax I used to do everything niko na shop hadi na mshop ya yeye nikibai nguo na baiza kila mtu because I used to believe ah to you a lot wengine wata feel vibaya kwa na watu wengine so nilikuwa na balance I used to be your balance ya yeah. kama kama ana school fees ya Lewis na niko na do I'll pay haya kama ana rent ya Nax ama sije nini na mimi ndo niko na do ama I'll pay I used to do that time you remember mama may give birth to your nuts so alikuwa na swapia watoto shule so akaniambia hiyo time akaniambia manze twende nuts to enroll watu hii kwa shule mpya nataka so nikaenda tukachukua Melissa na first the first na, na Lewis tukawapeleka hiyo shule wanasoma we bought school uniform mimi na yeye and i paid we bought we, we bought sorry we bought school uniform the kailen me want to show off we bought school uniform ka nitakisha watoto wako poa nikaenda bata nikawabaia viatu unajua like a good mom like a good mom mwenye anapenda watu wote so 2018 we moved in together kitengela sasa officially tuwakuje kuishi kama familia hiyo time hamu kaniambia sasa babe i want you to quit chachil show to 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 combine our effort and we make hamu great so nikakubali nikakaa home tunasaidiana kuandika mistari anaenda na perform nikakaa home eh hey, ikafika time E hey, madangu ju my mom alikuwa ananitegemea ikafika place hadi kiateka ananipigia na niambia atamfungia nyumba so nikamwambia mo there is no option because wewe ukipata do zako mimi sizioni mimi i'll go back to work ndio nisaidie mama yangu so i went back to work so this time i was staying at home nilikuwa na run social media accounts zake zote so ndio time akapata kazi hot 96 akaanza kwenda hot 96 And tunafanya research pamoja ya show tunatafuta quotes you know hadi venye niliamua kwenda kurudi job ha mwaka kasirika sasa i'm rebellious unajua and i was not rebellious my mama ananitegemea nyumba yake ni ka 20k bado maji bado shopping she's expensive so i had to go back to work hey 2019 ikafika 
Jamtai got pregnant again with the baby girl now, Kaylee. Hmm. So we used to leave place in Guinea in a modern coat. This place, I'm all going to job and I took around four, I'm at three thirty. No place. Alikuwa na jifungulienga gate. So for a long time ilikuwa na mbea hamo. Hebu tuwame tutoke hapa. Tuende kwa nyumba ingine nye. Tutapata tuta kuna watchman. Tutakuwa tunafunguliwa gate. Na kandu hapa na tuka etu hapa. Hiyo nyumba ilikuwa nga 13k. 13k. I... So around that. Around ni September huko August. Nikapigiwa na safari kwa mtena. They want me for an advert. But I was so pregnant. Nikasema ntenda. Diyo tuhame. And nikenda nikafanya advert. Nikalipwa poa. Nikaham tukambia nikambia Musa finally ndio ipe saibu tu hame twende place utakuwa unafunguliwa gate because pale tunakaa msee kisha jo system yako system for you natokanga late unatokanga mapema na unarudi late I gave birth in 2019 October aha uh -huh. sasa hapo ndio madhangu akakuja eh hey, madhangu akakuja atupata Christmas tuko hamo went to Naxo hiyo Christmas tulikuwa na mama huko but alikuja usiku alikuja alikuja yeye na mabro zake na beshte yao kutuona usiku hiyo Christmas walitoka Naxo kakam so usiku manzi atu na do mimi si na do hamo aje nipe do mimi na watoto wangu mimi I'm breastfeeding Kelly kuna Jeremy na kuna mama tulipika mchele cabbage imagine we didn't have money because kwa sababu nilipata kwa safari kwa I settled my mom na nikalipa huko and I bought some few stuff for the baby. Oh so, January 2020 ndio imefika. Hey. Uh, we are I mean kajambe chemo you know what you need to go back to work. Unaona vinyo vitu zinaendelea leo. Mimi sioni kitu. Yaani I don't know I don't see pesa ya mwe naenda anga wapi. Sioni anything. So nikaja nikamwambia by the way ha mimi mimi nitaenda kazi. Nitaenda kazi. Akaniambia hey by the way mom sina sijua aje lipo huko 96 ama ilikuwa aje uh, kina kinataka kina Lewis na na, na, na Melissa wende shule because Jeremy was also enrolling akanambia to after school fees kwanza to pay uh, Melissa na Lewis to enroll shule first and then tutaya sort Jeremy nikapigia mama beshte ma, beshte yangu mama fulani hapo akanitumia 30k enye I, I struggled to pay that money because it didn't pay back ni kamtumia akalipe kina Lewis shule kina Lewis went to school corona hmm? hmm. ndio hii eh? mama wangu ananitegemea i'm paying my mom's rent i'm ini nikaanza kuuza vitu online eh chemu struggle is real so inanipata sasa zingine nimeenda kupeleka nguo kikuyu the traffic kurudi huku the traffic hamu anakasirika eh tukakosania hapo kukosana ikakuwa a very serious kukosana ile serious sasa juu at some point aliniambia by the way hata huyo mtoto mdogo si wangu niko really hamu really unasema hivyo jo mtoto wako akai akai make gospel truth we even hadi tukaanza kwenda kuona counselor tusaidie because nilifeel ushai feel ni kama mtu amechukua break akagugonga nayo kwa uso because how can you say that about a small girl na siku moja mtu akasikia ulisema kitu kama hiyo aambiwe you know I'm, I'm sorry to say this itakuwa public but it's the truth you can say amo for other nilikuwa naongea na best yake akaniambia yeye amo alisema alitisha DNA nikakata nikakata na tulienda hadi kwa dr Susan Thika nikamwambia dr Susan kitu imenileta hapa nataka tufanye DNA amo alipe ama tuchange because you can say that about a small baby inani hata za mom i know the truth amo knows me than anyone else yeye ndo tunashindanga na yeye ndo ananijua and this girl aki oi edgar at anatembea <laughs> eh, kama hamo ili usha yona replica ya mtu because where i come from mimi si mweupe hamo wako na some weupe in, in him you know so sometime in in october akanza to mother nukambe nini hamo you choose you choose kama utaka hapa ama utakuwa unaniyesha mother because it's not fair so he chose to walk out akajiambia hey and that was the beginning of me to struggle to pay the rent but kitu ilinisaidia my mom went to to shago so at least baden ya mom ikapungua kidogo so i'm struggling with the babies mind you sina job hiyo time sikuwa na herself joseph wangu alienda jo alinembea na chelo kumlipa and she left so i was with my babies my biggest my biggest issue na harmony akwa na treating watu equally what Hamo is a biological father kwa watu wote but akona favorites. Na mimi 
I'm just a mom na na treat watoto wote equally hadi mom you know everyone sister yake siju na ni nilikuwa na treat kila mtu equally but hey, kifika je kina je eh i can't remember time mama mengi supermarket na akakuja na kiatu tena baia jeremy it has never happened ama ta siju nini ameletea mtu hii keki ya birthday never Is Edgar I've lived with the Hamo since 2018 2019 2020 Can you imagine hii nyumba watoto wangu wanaishi ya mimi 2018 nilikuwa housewife kidogo na msaidia ku build career 2019 I got pregnant na bado nasaidia mama yangu 2020 corona ndio hii 2021 ndio hii Can you believe hii nyumba yetu hata watoto wangu hawana TV television set because their dad aku buy na mimi pesa nilikuwa napata i buy food i pay household hamu anakuja kwa nyumba analipa rent he sleeps and kesho anamka anaenda out 96 house watu yongo wana tv hatuna fridge hatuna kuka hatuna anything we are just sisi ulala by nine but nilijambia hiyo si priority for now they need food that's why nikaamua kuuza account yangu manze I don't like your publicity but siko na option. Mind you last term la, the whole of last term Jeremy akwenda shule because I didn't have the school fees. So alikuwa anakatwa around. Watu wakinuliza hey, mtoto aende shule naambia nataka kumbadilishia shule but siko na fee. Hmm? So like a month ago to nikajaribu ku call her more my son was not feeling well the the first baby. Nikam call man shock on me nilipata nimeblockiwa nimekula block imagine so ni, 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 kitu najua tu he doesn't want anything to do with his kids with us and i'm so okay with that kama inampea peace ni sawa but shida ni asikuje baadaye ku corrupt watoto akili it won't, it won't be fair it won't be fair kabisa na ndio hiyo basi ah jemu tai anasema kwamba professor hamo uh, ambaye bado unajua anafanya kazi katika Hot 96 eh, akiwa pamoja na Jeff Koinange. Eh, pia ni comedian mm, ni comedian pia ambaye amekubalika sana kwa mimi namkubali sana kazi yake. Uh, sijui hebu toa maoni niambie utumbie mambo ya kuvipia ni eh, ili swala la watu ama ma celebrity kuweza kupata watoto E, na kisha hawajibiki. E, itakuwa je, hebu sema toa maoni yako hapo katika comment section kisha. Azidi e, kusubscribe unajua pia. E, smash hiyo kengele eh, notification bell kisha uweze kupata uh, video zingine uh, pindi tutakapozi rusha mtandao. Asante. Kwa heri kwa sasa.